guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to do curly ink for August. <laughs> That's my dog. <laughs> She's trying to get comfortable. So we're going to do curly ink for August. I got some stuff, some thoughts, some hair. Um, <laughs> anyways, let's get started. Um, so first on the chopping block, um, Let's see. I had this inked. This is my pen BBS four five six in gloom. There's something iffy going on with it. It would not work properly. So um, I inked it like halfway through last month. That's why I wasn't in my currently inked. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take it apart and see what's what because I love that pen and I hate to have it not work. Um, let's get started. So this is. Are we going to try and be a little bit neater than we were last month? Yes, probably. So this is 2022. So we're going to start with this one. I haven't pulled this one out in a while. And this is my Lamy Imperial Blue. Lamy Studio. And this was my very first um, custom grind. This has a medium cursive italic. I decided to ink it with Sailor Studio 123, which I also haven't used in who knows how long. Um, we'll see how this goes. We'll see how this goes. So this is, this is my first time trying them together. So Lamy Studio Medium, Curse of Italic. This is Sailor. 123. Oh, uh oh, I'm already having some issues here. It's feeling a little draggy and a little dry. So we'll see how it does in my journal because this is a journaling pen. We'll see how that goes. Um, next up, we have again an oldie but a goodie. Haven't used this in forever, and this is Birmingham Pen Company's. Ooh. Night King, but I don't remember the model. I don't know if it's a 6th Avenue. I don't remember. It's been a few years. This has a Knox medium nib, two-tone medium nib. I love this nib so much. <laughs> and uh, I'm sad that they, they're gone. And I have it inked with um, Birmingham Pen Comedy Tesla coil because, yes. So this is a Birmingham Pen Company. Night King with a medium nib. Oh, this is a good match. This is a good combo. Like really nice. I also really, really love this ink. It's probably one of my favorites. Well, to be honest, I actually really like all the Burning Up and Company inks I do have. Um, Oh, also, I know that last month I had an issue with, oh, which one did I ink? I don't know, one of my pens and uh, Dragonfly Twinkle, and I switched it over to a Nemesine, and it worked fantastic. Like, I used the whole thing up, so just thought I'd bring that up. Um, next, I have my Platinum Placier, Placier, whatever, uh, and this is also with uh, a Birmingham Pen Company ink. This is Waterfront Dusk. Um, that is the old formula. I think the new one, the color changed from what I hear. I don't know. So this is and then this here. This has a fine nib. Waterfront. Wow. A lot of words. I like this ink. It's feeling pretty good in this pen. It's nice. Um, this is a planner pen. My next planner pen. I'm giving this another try. I'm trying to be fair, and this is a Sailor Compass with a what is it? Medium fine nib. It's never been really my favorite. I just felt it was too scratchy and. It annoyed me because I paid too much for it to be so scratchy. <laughs> and this is a Van Diemen's ink, Spotted Sun Orchid. I really like that ink. So 
this is. Now it's still scratchy. Man, demons. What did I say it was? Sunspotted? No, spotted sun. See, I always do that. I don't hate it, hate it, but it's not my favorite pen. Which is probably why it's still around. And I just got ink on my finger from somewhere. Don't know where. Okay, next up. Look, I got it. I got the Twisby 580 Iris. I they had to. I love the 580. It's one of my favorite pen models. So I had to get it. It's so pretty. Mine leans very purple. Right here it has pretty much the whole spectrum. There's the rings right here on the edge are very, I don't know, green, yellow, bluish, very purple right here. And like, it's just, it's so dang pretty. Um, I ink this with, <laughs> I had to use my favorite, right? Van Diemen's um, Twilight Mist. Come on. <laughs> it did give me a little trouble. I, I won't lie. Um, which is expected because it's a shimmer ink and I've never had really good luck with Twisby and shimmer inks. It, it's just me. I don't know. Maybe I'm picky. 580. Iris. And I got this in a medium name. However, once I got it going, it's pretty nice. They're, they're working together quite nice. And my journal seems to like this combo too. So, yeah, I'm happy about that. And lastly, another Twisby. This is the Twisby uh, Swipe. Mine has a uh, stub nib. Look at that. Do you see that shimmer in there? Nice. Um, color of scat. That's just too pretty. So this is, and it's super wet. This be swipe 1.1 color verse cat. Like super wet. Which is a good thing because being a shimmer ink, it really throws all the shimmer on the page. It's so nice. Again, my journal loves this, loves that pen combo. Um, yeah, that's it. I don't have that many ink for August. Um, let's get up close because some of these are looking nice. I can see a lot. I can see the shading in that 123, which is nice. That's why I picked that pen. Um, Tesla coil, gorgeous. Okay, but look at Cat. Do you see that shimmering Cat? It's so pretty. Uh, good colors, blue and purple, I guess. It's a mood. So anyways, that is it for August Currently Ink. How easy was that? If you guys have any questions, let me know down below and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye.